Greetings, patrons. So this is an important video for the services that I provide you guys. What I am doing is I'm changing the way I've done things in the past and I'm doing it into, uh, I'm trying to design it, or I am designing it, around a machine model approach where we're gonna have certain data points that are gonna come in and we're gonna have certain data points that go out and we're going to try to find out the greatest patterns that can help us correlate with that data, those data points coming in. But also, before we even get to the point of finding those correlations, the, the, spread, the data itself will be useful to you guys. It will be a service that is extremely valuable um, and so what I'm going to do is uh, provide expiring links for, in Patreon because, you know, this is going to be the, something I'm spending a lot of money on. I'm spending resources and money on individuals to fill these data sheets. Um, that's one of the things I'm doing is, is hiring someone to uh, get the data because I can't do it without the data. And I've tried getting AI to do these evaluations, but the AI doesn't understand what it's doing. So the only thing I can do is get a human being to fill in the data. And then from there, I'll do the math uh, uh, analytics and I'll focus solely on the analytics and finding the patterns that work. Now, the goal here is for you guys to provide any project that you want me to put into that research. Now, don't put garbage projects because it, it is a waste of my money. It's a waste of our time if we go and look at projects that don't have any leads, don't have teams that are public. We want um, projects that have decent amount, like a decent amount of information available so that, you know, we could fill in those data points. If, if it's like something from, you know, like from these little sites and they don't have any information, don't put it in the list because it's going to waste our time. Um, but here, I'm going to show you guys here of uh, what we're doing. Um, so, you know, what it is, is you can see here, let me see if, uh, let me move this. So this is a Google sheet that I'm looking at right here. And the, this is the data points that are coming in. Um, this is going to be a vector for those who know any, like what I'm talking about, this is going to be the vector. And then I'm going to come up with the matrices and the, um, you know, I, I haven't figured out how I'm going to make that machine model yet. But, you know, this is an ongoing process, but this is the vector. This is going to be our inputs. And, um, and you know, we're just now starting it, and I'm collaborating with one of my um, Intrepid DAO uh, members to help build this. And, you know, he's running through that right here. You know, he's starting to fill those out. Um, it takes about an hour for, to fill out one of these, these columns or these rows. Um, but our, my goal is that I'm going to build this up to hundreds of projects. And trust me, that's going to be quite expensive. Um, so Intrepid Gains is going to be, you know, me basically uh, putting my money into this and um, building something here that will be a machine model exclusive to patrons and, you know, and, and DAO holders as well. Um, you know, and then well, I'll figure out where I go from there. But this, these analytics is where I'm starting. So, right, you guys are all already familiar with this sheet. Um, you know, this is what I have now from all of my history of research, from my, um, from, from my research. But I'm, I'm, I'm re-architecturing it so that you can go to this page right here. Yeah, let me see if I can show you. So you, this is the one you're all familiar with. So now it's gonna, be, it's gonna be structured differently. I'm going to keep this model of the day analysis and a lot of references are going to reference it because I have so much project history in there. And what I'm going to do is I'm just going to use that to just kind of fill in. But eventually it will move to the back. But there's definitely going to be links to it from into the other data sheets. So it's going to be a, a, a ongoing relevant piece of architecture. But this is where you're going to want to go from now on when we get, you know, like you're going to look here first and you're going to look here. These are going to be the places where you're going to look for any project you're interested to see if it's already there. And this is where you're going to get a quick analysis with links and with the important information on a project. So um, this will save you lots of time in your personal research. And as time goes on, we're going to build, you know, this is going to be the, I haven't built this yet, but I'm, I'm, this is where the math, um, this is just going to be the outputs of performance. Um, you know, and, and when that uh, gets filled, and I'm and I'm going to just have it linked to a lot of the projects here, and pull in those data, and and then you know use these these projects and, and fill in data, etc. Um, to just have the outputs, 
And then, so, so we're going to have the inputs, the outputs, and then we're, the, what I'm going to work on um, is coming up with, this is where the value is going to be built in the machine models. So there's several layers of value here, but the point of this video is to highlight the changes that are coming. Um, and what I'm doing is that I am, I'm, I'm going to focus my uh, resources on providing you with information. And right now is, um, let me put this on full screen so you guys get the point. So the, what I'm focusing now on is, look, we're in a bear market. I might as well like build this now and it's going to cost me you know, money to do this. Uh, but it's, it's going to be extremely valuable to you as patrons to use this. this. This is the time when you can get rich because the market looks like crap. The, stock, the, tr the large, like I've shorted the market, the, the, the S&P, it might run, who knows? I'm waiting to open another short in like six months because typically it takes forever for the stock market to crash. So if we're going to be in a bear market for a year, two years, I'm, I'm fine with that because I'm going to build this data sheet for patrons. And if people like people are either going to be smart enough to know what I'm building here or they're not, because this is going to be um, a valuable asset, a valuable database for for just the data. Even if I didn't do the correlations, you can come here and you can see whether the team is public. Um, you can see whether they have PhDs on the team. You can see whether they're developers. You can see if the product is live. You know, you can see the inflation rate. You can see the all. You know, you can see the important data points. And, um, and then what I'm going to do from there is I'm going to uh, build uh, math models and I'm just going to practice my math skills and um, find the patterns for if you, and, and this is the bottom line, this is the bottom value, and I'm going to end this video so that, it, um, it, you know, how people remember the last thing said, right? The bottom line is I'm going to perform these patterns from the information and what we're going to do is know that if at any time you research a project and you fill in these data points, you're going to have a good guess at a random point in time where it will fall in, prob in, in returns. So that's a very valuable asset because what I'm doing is I'm just researching at random or researching these projects based on what you bring me. You guys are pretty much the guys that are just going to, whatever projects you're interested, please provide only projects that are valuable. You're going to provide these projects and we're, and it's pretty much random time, times that you fill in the information. And so what the result will be is that any random time when you evaluate a project, when you have the given outputs, like the outputs we're going to have, you're going to be able to find a relative probably probability of what the expected performance will be. And you're going to see it. Um, I'm going to do it based on the distribution curve and we'll, I'll even come up with a graph eventually of the distribution curve of where these fall. And then, you know, we'll use, uh, you know, it's all math, AI models are math. So, we're, you know, I'll just keep coming up with math that will come up with more and more useful correlations. All right, guys, so that's what I'm doing now. That's what I'm trying to build here. And that's where I'm gonna put a significant amount of my effort. All right, later guys.